now come back to the problem identification the first phase of any machine learning project is the developing and understanding of the problem requirements you know to know what problem we are trying to solve before attempting to solve it so what 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 the what is meant by this whatever problem we have to solve first of all we understand that problem thoroughly and listen until what kind of that problem wants a solutions that has to be clear before solving that problem so what are the quick questions to be answer included so answer must be included that what the problem objective that requires a cognitive solutions what part of the solution are cognitive and what aren't have all the necessary technical and development issue has been addressed is any special requirement for transparency explainability bias reduction what are the ethical considerations what is the success criteria acceptable accuracy evaluation parameters what are the expected inputs to the models and expected outputs what are the characteristic of the problem being solved in this classification regression or clustering problem is this that means what kind of problem is, is it what is the heuristic the quick and dirty approach to solving the problem that doesn't require machine learning how much better than the heuristic does the model need to be how will benefit of the model to be measured so the problem identification is your machine learning project go or no go so the business feasibility is there is a clear problem definition is the organization willing to invest in change is there a sufficient roi or impact next come to the data feasibility do you have the required data that measure what you care about is there a sufficient quantity of data needed to train system and do you have access to that data is the data is sufficient quality or the implementation feasibility do you have any required technology and skills can you execute the model as a required in a timely manner does it make sense to use the model where you plan to use it so this is a machine learning project go or no go this is a these are the criteria while considering go or no go so what is clustering not classification first to go this what is clustering clustering is nothing but to gather the same types of labels or terms same types of data sets or the dependent kind of works to each other is called clustering and the classification is nothing but whether it is spam or not spam or whether it is the type a data type b type b data type c data this is called classification so usually classification is referred to as a problem observing data and deciding to which class is atom belongs that is a cat or dog the typical classes are known in advance something we care about clustering is a typical referred to when we have the data but no labels that are associated with each atom that is no predefined notation of notion of cats and dogs in this group in this problem is to cluster an atom into groups so that atom in each group resemble each other it can be used a particular algorithm will necessary will classify for example pet image into cats and dogs but it may also end up clustering them to other group based on colors pose size and you know, other characteristic so this is the mix up situations the key is that clustering is typically done in the unsupervised domain that is there are no predefined classes in known in advance so the clustering basically it will gather the same amount of data with respect to single characteristic only but in other clustering algorithms it may be take data from the same type of data for different characteristics so the clustering may be get confusion so classification is also coming to the picture 
so the classification the email classification spam or no spam sanction loan to customer if it is yes capable of paying emi then sanction loan amount no if he can't so this is the classification so these are the example the cancer tumor cells are identification it is critical or non critical so it will classify classification of news that into the predefined cases politics sports health so this is the classification on what are the clustering marketing discover customer seg- segments for making purpose Bi- uh, biology classification among of different species of plants and animals libraries clustering different books on the basis of the topic and the informations insurance sectors according to the customer their policies are identifying their frauds city plannings earthquake studies this is how it is work so coming to the next slides problem identification regression what is the temperature is going to be tomorrow this is how the regression works and the classification will it be cold or hot tomorrow so the regression is is called what we call what is the temperature going tomorrow it will try to predict it and classification will just will classify on the basis of the label whether it's a cold or hot so this is the how these two uh, methods or can be compared to each other so regression and classification hopefully you understand this so uh, on to the upcoming slides we would like to know the clustering the clustering of the 4k means clustering in terms of the full z500 field with unit of meters of zero zero day summer months june august and for winter months december february right columns so here they have given this june august may june to august c1 is there c2 is there c3 is there c4 is there so what the june august uh clustering in the data set of the weather forecast it is mentioned here in the june august and december and february summer it's a given the heat wave how it will be appear for the june august for c1 c2 c3 june july august that is c1 for june c2 for july and c3 for june july august these are the case study and c4 is random one in which according to to up to the june and august similar goes for the december and february the c1 is for december c2 is for january c3 is february and c4 in is random between among three months so this will give the average for the clustering issue so the how the clustering is used to identify the weather forecast or temperature related to data so this is the how is it is the how the clustering is work